Thank you, Mr. President. We have a, a particularly difficult problem of an exacerbation of a health disparity. We've known literally forever that diseases like diabetes, hypertension, obesity, and asthma are disproportionately afflicting the minority populations, particularly the African Americans. Unfortunately, when you look at the predisposing conditions that lead to a bad outcome with coronavirus, the things that get people into ICUs that require intubation and often lead to death, they are just those very comorbidities that are unfortunately disproportionately prevalent in the African American population. As Governor Cuomo articulated today, uh, hospital admissions uh, continue to decline. Uh, and uh, in our report early this morning uh, from Dr. Burks, we continue to see evidence of stabilization uh, in some of the areas around the country of the most significant outbreak, the New York metro area, including New Jersey, Long Island, and Connecticut, New Orleans metro area, Detroit, Boston, Chicago, and, and Denver, uh, as Dr. Burks will explain, continue to uh, give evidence of stabilization.